Dennis Hayes, let me start with you. You coordinated the first Earth Day, and as I said, it was more than 50 years ago. Why were you so concerned at that time about uh, the global environment? Well, uh, actually in 1970, although we named this event Earth Day, it was, it was actually much more United States Environment Day. We were focused upon local, regional, and national issues. There were a bunch of them then. People worried about air pollution, water pollution, toxic substances, endangered species, freeways cutting through inner city neighborhoods, and on and on. Uh, but all of them lacked the clout to be able to really achieve much politically. And the purpose of that first Earth Day was to take all of these dozens of disparate threads of issues and weave them together into the fabric of a unified movement with similar values called environmentalism. Looking ahead, uh, what gives you the most hope that we can still save the planet? I suppose two things. One, the upwelling of grassroots enthusiasm. All animals have a desire for survival, and I believe that's true for the human animal as well. And it's now beginning to manifest itself in ways that I think are making it easier and easier to uh, organize people politically. And the second thing that's happening coincidentally is this rapid development of renewable energy technology, right. super efficient technologies.